Hi, and thank you for tuning in to the Daily Dose for Spiritual Growth. This week, we've been talking about the troubles of life and how do we face those troubles? What encourages us? What gives us hope when we're in the middle of hard times? We all face hard times. We all have things in life that cause us stress, that overwhelm us, that bring us to our knees. Do you feel tired today? Do you feel overwhelmed today? Do you feel stress and anxiety today? Where do you find hope in those moments? I want to read some verses to you from the book of Isaiah chapter 40. Listen to what it says in verse 28. Do you not know and have you not heard? The Lord is the everlasting God, the creator of the ends of the earth. He will not grow tired or weary and his understanding no one can fathom. It's just reminding us of the vastness of God, the might and power of God, the strength of God. It goes on in verse 29. He gives strength to the weary and increases the power of the weak. Even youths grow tired and weary and young men stumble and fall, but those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. There's so many things in life that claim to give us hope. There's so many things in life that claim to give us peace, that will help us in times of trouble. Maybe you've tried some of those things out. They fail. They don't sustain us when we're going through hard times. Our hope needs to be in the Lord. Our hope and our strength in times of weakness comes from him alone. When was the last time that you turned to God and received hope. Spending time in his word and you just felt hope come over you. It might still have been in the middle, maybe nothing in your circumstance changed, but the presence of God gave you a peace indescribable and there was a hope in the present and a hope for the future that God is in control. Is it enough for you to know that God is in control? Is that enough? Because there are times in life where everything seems out of control and yet we can hold tight to the truth of the word of God that nothing is beyond his grasp. Remember what it says. The Lord is the everlasting God. He's the creator of the ends of the earth. He will not grow tired, tired and weary. And his understanding no one can fathom. Put your hope in the Lord. Trust in him. Trust that he knows. Trust that he's moving. Trust that he's doing something. Trust that he loves you. Trust that he's got it all under control. It's hard sometimes when things seem out of control. I get that. So maybe what you need to do today, maybe what I need to do today, is say, God, would you renew my strength? Would you renew my hope? Would you remind me of your goodness? Remind me of your faithfulness. God, bring to mind past circumstances that seemed hopeless that you got me through. Past situations that seemed out of control that you brought calm to. Remind and reflect yourself. Reflect and remind yourself today of how good your God is and put your hope in him. Thank you so much for tuning in today and I hope to see you again tomorrow for another daily dose for spiritual growth.